Welcome to my channel. I go by Boiler Dan One. Today I'm going to install this Win Model 3410 air filtration system. My garage is not that large. It's probably a standard two-car garage, and I do some woodworking on model ships and some things like that. And even though I, I use a vacuum to suck out the dust as I'm cutting it and different things, some things I don't hook up to the vacuum system. I'm hoping that this will take those small particles out of the air. Now it is all pre-assembled. The only thing I have to do is suspend it from my ceiling. Here it is out of the box and there are two ways you can use it. You could actually set it on the floor. It has four little feet and filter the air that way or you can suspend it from the ceiling. It weighs about 31 pounds. Light enough that I can handle it. This is where your clean air would come out comes with a remote. It takes two AA batteries. They are not included with the package. So you've got one button for speed, one is a timer. You can have it automatically shut off in one hour, two hours, or four hours. Or you can just leave it run continuous. And there are three different speeds. Here's speed one. And I tied the ribbons on there just to try and give you an idea of airflow. The unit itself is, is quiet. I'm, I don't, you know, all I hear is airflow. I don't hear the motor running. And I'm, what, 18 inches away? That is the lowest speed. Medium. Again, more airflow, but I'm not hearing anything as far as motor or vibration. All I'm hearing is the uh, whoosh of the air and then high. Same thing, I'm not really hearing the motor, there's no vibration and the only thing is, is it's increased airflow and it's got a pretty good uh, pretty good airflow. So if you want it to be timed you just push this yellow time button and you can see it ignites as to what you're doing. There's one hour, next push is two hours or four push it again it shuts that off and it would run continuous and then a manual off button also this is the back side this will be where the arrow goes in you can easily see if the filter is dirty and this arrow just pops and I assume the filter just slides out then you have an inner filter which uh, will filter even finer particles out and that just easily slides out for replacement. There is a uh, like a spongy sealing material around the edge here to seal this in place. Inner filter just simply slides in. The size of this filter is 422 by 246 by 45 all in millimeters. So if you want that in inches it is technically it is nine and nine sixteenths of an inch as far as the height length right at sixteen and a half depth is one and three quarters gives you the direction the airflow is supposed to go it's basically just a miniature furnace filter It does have a double click, like I thought it was done right there. It's not. It actually goes further than that. So it pushes the filter in fairly firmly. If you're going to suspend from the ceiling, there are four bolts you need to take out. Next, these hooks, there's a locking net that go on these. You have to and you'll have to attach those. Here's a little trick on how to uh, get those in quicker. It's a 10 millimeter nut to tighten, make that secure. And I'll have to look and see if how I want these hooks facing. I did pre-drill this hole 
So I get it started by hand. And then for three of the four, you can take one of the other hooks, hook it in here, but be careful. Don't get your finger around that while it's twisting and turn your uh, drill on slow speed. outward so I've got 12 inches between these and then across where the joist is is 24. For the last one you can either turn it in by hand if you have an extra hook somewhere you can use that you could use a screwdriver or in this case my open end wrench. Here the unit is installed. I'm actually going to put it higher than that, but I'm gonna wait until either my son or son-in-law are here so they can help raise it up so I can shorten those chains. Ideally, you wanna have it at least seven feet off the, the floor, three feet away from any wall or corner. I've got the three feet easily, but I need to get it raised higher. So that will work. I'm hoping when I'm working the airflow will suck up the small dust particles and put them in the filter. So here's your remote. Distance on it is fine. You don't even have to point it at it. Anywhere in your garage is fine. Low speed. Does give a little beep when it turns on. Not noisy at all. I mean, I'm right beneath it. So that's my initial review of the Model 3410 Win air filtration system. I will follow this up in a few months and let you know how it's working and if I think it's uh, getting the extra dust out of the air. I want to thank everyone for watching. Have a great day.